is Hump Clan back with another Minecraft video. This is the fourth episode of the Stranded Isle series. Now, this, if, for those of you who are new, this is a series on one of the many Minecraft tutorial worlds on the Legacy console version. Now, technically, I'm not on the console version. I'm actually playing on Java Edition, but um, I recommend you guys watch the prologue if you're wondering what the series is. It explains it pretty well. But anyway, in this episode, we are going to be creating a potato farm because we need a food source before my steak runs out. Hang on, what is this? This is taller than I remember. Mineville News? Read all about it. There's news here? Newsflash, local billionaire missing? Wait. Wait. Huh? Could that be... Okay, could that be the dude who owned that mansion that we went to in the last episode? I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to think about it too much right now. Local chef creates new potato recipe. Must, <laughs> must try. Okay. Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and start up a farm. Um, myself a nice hoe. You know what? How much iron do I have? Here we go. One, two, three. Give yourselves a bucket. I think that will be helpful. Um, I just did. Oh my goodness! It's our little potato friend. Hey, buddy. You know what? I'm literally about to make a potato farm. You can live here if you want. How does that sound? Okay, it looks like he wants to do that. All right, here. Um, let me start planting it. I'm just going to put it right here. So, oh, that already ruined itself. There we go. I'm going to go grab some water with my bucket, and I'm going to probably grow all this into, like, a little potato farm in this whole little room here. <laughs> it looks like our friend is all excited. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, here. Let's run out real quick to... I think there's a river over here? No, but there is water, so that's what matters. I'm going to go ahead and grab a bucket full of water and bring it back. Oh, our little potato man is following us. <laughs> and then, you know what? I probably should have made two buckets so that we could do this all in one trip, but I'm going to have to make an infinite water source, but it's fine. Um... Hmm, where should the water source be? How about in this corner? Like, like so. Okay, now I need to go back and grab more water. <laughs> okay, so something I want to do in this episode is that village over there has farmers. So I want to talk to them and see if we can purchase any seeds. Oh, he's chilling in the water. Oh my goodness. He's so small. It's hilarious. It's like a swimming pool for him. <laughs> so there's our infinite water source. Now I just need to go around and put little blobs of water around our crops. Um, you know what? I should uh, turn all this into a potato farm as well. And then I want to clear over here. Oh, we got wheat seeds too. Perfect. You know, let's do a little bit of, of lawn work right here. Just a little bit. And um, I'm going to go I'm gonna put water here. And then all around it, let's go ahead and put some wheat. Oh, there's the achievement. Okay, apparently you only get that for uh, planting wheat seeds, but, you know. Okay, here's gonna be our little garden for now. Although, you know, it may end up needing to be bigger because I don't think it's gonna get us a whole lot of food. Mr. Potato's home? Oh my goodness, he's moved into this house. The, you know, I think, Mr. Potato, I think this is gonna fit you perfectly. You know, Wait, hold on, can you fit on these shelves? If you crouch, can you fit in that? <laughs> oh, okay, Mr. Potato can't. He's not quite that small. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is actually a really cool house. There's got a sink over here. There's a second floor. There's a bedroom. Oh my goodness, a bathtub that is perfect sized for B Potato Man. A little bit of a big toilet, but you know, uh, I'll let you figure that out. <laughs> okay, let's head down here and I'm gonna fill up my bucket. And now what I don't wanna do, uh, once I've cleared out my inventory a little bit, so let's dump some stuff in here is I want to get our emeralds out of our piggy bank. And let's head over to the village next door uh, and see if they have anything for sale seed-wise. Because I have eight emeralds that Hobo Joe gave us in the last episode for heading over to the manor. Um, so let's see. What do you have for sale? Huh. Looks like he's a little bit busy, but he does want to trade. Showing off all his goodies. Let's see. All right, so we've got 20 wheat for an emerald, 22 carrots for an emerald, 22 carrots for an emerald, 26 potatoes for an emerald, and then it's locked. So I can't purchase 
um, apples or pumpkin pie quite yet. I really would like to get... Wait, can I? No, I can't. Okay, so that's probably the next episode. Or, uh, level, I mean. Not episode, why did I say that? <laughs> so we need to trade with these dudes to level them up. So maybe I can do some, uh, work for them and work in their crops a little bit. But I'm not gonna do that in this moment. So I'm gonna head back to the house. One thing I would like to do is put a little fence gate there. Because I really am uncomfortable. You know, I don't have I don't have enough wood. I'm really uncomfortable that a creeper or a zombie or something is gonna just, like, walk in here while I'm gardening and blow up my garden. So let's go ahead and get a little bit of wood and upgrade that a little bit. This episode's really just kind of working around the base, building our house up a little bit. Maybe we can go and get to know some more townsfolk in a little bit. I already have some sticks. Okay, here we go. Fence gate. Perfect. Oak fence gate. Should fit perfectly. There we go. Now that's all secure. Is there a lantern outside here? No, there isn't. I'm going to put a... Or not lantern, a torch. Torch out there as well. Um, and maybe I'll put a torch on the side too. So it's all lit up. This is like our own little, like, little yard space. And also, yeah, we do have a backyard here. I really like this backyard. If you guys have any ideas of things I should add to this, please let me know down below. Okay. Okay. Let's bring our emeralds back to the piggy bank real quick. Alrighty. Where's our little potato friend? I wonder where he went. What in the world? He's growing potatoes in his house? <laughs> this is hilarious. Wait, there's a barrel? <gasps> Mr. Potato's food, though, so I'm not going to touch it. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, it's, we're going to, like, come back here. This place is going to gradually be more and more just potato. Just everywhere. Okay. I actually think that this is not going to be enough food. Uh, and I'm fairly certain we don't want to get any potatoes out of Mr. Potato's house. Mr. Potato's just chilling over here. So, I do not have dirt on me. This is going to require some dirt. We're going to make a nice fancy happy little garden I'm gonna go like this I don't want it that much we're gonna hoe all this and we're gonna put uh, potatoes everywhere potatoes galore I'm gonna put water there and then we can go like this so we can put even more potatoes it's gonna be like potato topia over here now let me grab my water stick it right there and we are, man, Mr. Potato is really doing decor. He's, already, he's got lanterns. Oh my goodness, Potato, where did you get all this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, oh, Potato gave me a lantern. Let's go. I don't think there's any lanterns in this world. So this is actually going to be quite special. Where should we, oh, right here. Oh, wait, I can't place it there. That's a off slab. Okay, let me think, let me think. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to run inside and I'm going to get sticks and we're going to get a fence and then we're going to go back outside and i'm going to go like this now we have a nice little corner light that will light up the alleyway next to our house <laughs> anyway i think that's going to be it for today's episode it is getting quite late yeah it's probably like almost one in the morning I'm going to say good night, Mr. Potato. I will see you in the morning, hopefully. Okay. Let's head to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a comment of your favorite thing this, that happened in this episode. If you have any ideas for other episodes, let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one.